welcome to the studio. Today I'm just going to talk about uh, a quick tip on how to clean your pastels. So there are a couple of different ways you could do them and they're all equally as valid. So let's just get started. So there are a number of different ways we can clean our pastels and I'll just show you a couple of them. The most simple way is to take a very soft brush. This is a very soft watercolour brush. And so, for example, this box of Terry Ludwig pastels, they're new and they're not very dirty, but you can see up here I've got a bit of purple on there, so I just dust it off carefully, just give them a very gentle dust with the, and that will clean up those pastels nicely. Now the thing you want to be careful when you're cleaning the pastels is you're not creating a lot of dust that's going uh, in your face, in your lungs, so you can wear a mask when you're doing it or you can take them outside. But these are not very dirty so I'm not worrying too much about it. So that's one way you can do it. And so another way to do it is to just take a container, fill it with some sort of grain, uh, small rough sort of textured uh, grain. Here I've used rice but I've used couscous, I've used quinoa, you can use whatever you like that's small and grainy. Put your dirty pastels in, put on a lid, and just give them a good old shake and the, the friction and the abrasiveness of those small grains will take off uh, the dirt from other pastels. If you're using a very small grain uh, like um, a corn, a rough corn meal, that kind of thing, then when you've done it, you can just strain it through, uh, tip all of it, the pastels and the grain, into a, a strainer and the grain will fall through if it's very small grains and that's a way to separate out the grains from your pastels don't need to worry with the with rice uh, then in in my big trays here i have rice just i have the pastels sitting on the rice all the time but even after a while that can get a bit dirty and so what i tend to do is just take a white cloth a paper towel and i just gently roll my pastel over it so this is a really good time when you're doing the cleaning. If your pastels have got a little bit uh, out of order in your box, then you can redo them. So maybe once a year, I'll do a really thorough clean of this box of pastels, which is my basic working box, and I will start grading them again. So I'll start with the lightest colours. Let's just have a little look at those. So I'll start with the lightest shades and tints down the bottom, moving my way up and I'll try and separate them into warmer and cooler uh, in, in the divisions and I've got blue, green, yellows, reds, pinks, purples, uh, ochres and then greys, neutral colours over here. The neutral colours. So it's a very good way when you're doing a general clean to sort out your boxes of pastels too. So that's just three quick tips on how to clean your pastels. Thanks for joining me in the studio today. See you next time. Bye for now.